gynecological health and fertility. That standardization along with the standardization of the teaching developed into what is now called the Creighton Model Fertility Care System, which is, if I might put it, you know, simply is a gynecologist's dream of a system. I mean, we're supposed to be experts in vaginal discharges. This is a system that guides you through all of that in a way that's easy, simple, reproducible. It has all the good concept of science behind it. Development of the Creighton Model Fertility Care System proved to be a watershed event, one that led to a new women's health science called NAPRO Technology. The surgical and medical practice of NAPRO Technology offers highly effective treatments to a range of reproductive health issues, including infertility. The foundation of NAPRO Technology depends on a thorough understanding of each woman's unique fertility cycle something achieved through the Creighton Model Fertility Care System and its accurate and daily tracking of biomarkers. See, the thing about what we're doing is that it comes down to a practical, everyday clinical reality. We can have a woman charter cycles, but it isn't just the charting, it's the information we get back from that. And so you get back to an issue like infertility. Infertility really is, is a disease or a condition where the fertility system is not working right. So, but if you don't understand what fertility is, it's hard to fix it. It's hard to find out what's wrong with it. With the guidance of a certified fertility care practitioner, Stephanie and Anthony began their first real search for answers to their infertility by charting using the Creighton Model Fertility Care System. Based on information from those charts, blood samples were taken from Stephanie on targeted days of her cycle and shipped to the National Reproductive Hormone Laboratory for analysis. Anthony's semen, acquired through a natural act of intercourse, was also analyzed. With new valuable information now in hand, the epilites traveled to Omaha and the Pope Paul VI Institute for a series of medical and surgical procedures to diagnose and treat a number of conditions, including endometriosis, blocked fallopian tubes, and a low sperm count. Fifteen months later, Stephanie gave birth to a daughter, Claire Marie Epilite. Today, the Epilites are frequently called upon to recount their journey to parenthood and their experience with the kind of approach to infertility practiced at most fertility clinics today. I thought that going to a fertility clinic meant seeing specialists, being diagnosed and treated, and being sent on your way. In retrospect, it is my firm belief that fertility clinics apply a cookie-cutter approach to solve problems as in you, the patient, must fit into one of their approaches to treatment. We would eventually have to travel to Omaha, Nebraska to see a true fertility specialist, a man of compassion, a man of God. Although Stephanie and Anthony realized their dream of having a child through the use of the Creighton Model Fertility Care System and NAPRO technology, there are no guarantees. But at the very least, couples taking part in this approach to human reproduction gain a far greater understanding of why they are not able to conceive. The Creighton Model and NAPRO technology answers many questions, often overlooked or simply ignored. This helps couples accept their infertility and allows them to move on to other options like adoption. But there is also real reason for hope. Documented research shows that couples using NAPRO technology have a far greater chance of becoming pregnant than other methods. Here's an overview of what couples can expect if they decide to explore the NAPRO technology approach to infertility. The process begins with an initial consultation with a NAPRO technology certified physician who obtains a complete medical history and other information from the couple, including symptoms they may be experiencing. The doctor might also suggest a gynecological exam for the woman and a semen analysis for the man. The couple is then asked to learn and begin charting in the Creighton Model Fertility Care System. Because charting is such a crucial element in diagnosing abnormalities, this education process is usually done under the personal, face-to-face -face direction of a certified fertility care practitioner. It can also take place by long distance, by phone, faxes, and emails. These practitioners undergo a vigorous training and education regimen to assure the highest standards of quality and service delivery for every couple. 
Very often, blood tests taken on specific days of the woman's cycle are suggested to determine hormone levels. Accurate charting is critical in determining days that blood should be drawn for analysis. Once a minimum of two cycles of charting are completed, the Creighton model charts and other information like blood tests and semen analysis are examined and evaluated by a NAPRO physician. The physician may at this time recommend an ultrasound scan or even a surgical evaluation to help reach a diagnosis of what may be wrong. Each procedure, including the advantages and disadvantages, is discussed in detail with the couple. With all the information in hand, the physician can then make a diagnosis of the problem. Reproductive abnormalities may be functional, they may be structural, or they may be a combination of both. The physician will discuss these details with the couple who are encouraged to ask questions. The next step is determining a course of treatment. This may involve medical applications of NAPRO technology, like progesterone injections or prescription drugs, or it may involve surgical treatment. Very often, it is a combination of both. Couples taking advantage of the NAPRO technology approach to infertility are encouraged to be patient. Patience is a real virtue in the evaluation and treatment of infertility, where success is a very real possibility. Couples should know that research conducted at the Pope Paul VI Institute for the Study of Human Reproduction show that NAPRO technology is one and a half to three times more effective than assisted reproductive techniques like in vitro fertilization. This is one of the best kept secrets in reproductive medicine today. The NAPRO technology approach to infertility is focused on the couple with communication between man and wife, a key element every step of the way. If I could just tell my story to one person, I said this all along the whole journey, if I could save one couple from going through all the emotions that we went through and tell it and let it be heard for what it's worth that um, I had done my job. So husbands and wives, I mean it's patience but it's just loving each other and um, just, you know, hanging on. We hope this presentation has been helpful to you as you continue with your struggle, your journey with infertility. And it is our hope and prayer that you will consider the Creighton Model Fertility Care System and NAPRO technology as you seek answers to questions along the way.